All right, I'm here with Hanover li uh, Rhinos linebacker Richard Settle. Um, first of all, first order of business has to be a team record. You had four fumble recoveries today. What's your thought on that? What goes into recovering four fumbles in one game? Uh, well, first I have a shout out to my man uh, Dustin. Two of them, because of him, I was able to get the ball. One of them I caused, um, and then I was able to recover. But honestly, just being at the right place, at the right time, um, hustling, being aware of the ball, and you know, obviously on the ground, it was really slippery. So both teams experienced a lot of kind of harsh conditions, even though it's beautiful out here right now. Um, it's really muddy on that field. So um, I mean, it was obviously nice, and it gave plenty of opportunities for our for our offense to get some some opportunities to go down there and score, but honestly, it didn't work out for that. Uh, you mentioned Dustin's effort. What specifically did he do to help you on those two plays? Uh, I mean, he's a big man, um, and he's quick. He has good hand, good hand movement, um, as well as uh, a motor. Uh, he's nonstop the whole time, so that really helps. Um, other teams just seeing him, um, they're definitely seeing a little more focus on him, and so it frees up space for me and Renal, you know, to go around and make some plays. Um, you spoke about Renal. He's um, leading the team in tackles, and it's going to be a showdown next week between the two leading tacklers in the league, uh, Kilpatrick for Franklin County and Renal. Um, are you excited to be a part of that? And what do you think that means to, to him to be able to be a part of? Yeah, I mean, obviously, like he's been uh, Renal's been in the league for a really long time now. A solid linebacker. He's smart, able to line up everyone, knows every position. Um, so definitely a huge key to our team a success that we have had. Uh, definitely can get point to him, point to you know Adam as well, putting time in our new defense, uh, as well as Noah as the new head coach. That would be a good job as far as not as much fighting, um, little things too. Like we were able to be work as a team. Obviously, we didn't get, we didn't score again, which is you got to score to win. Um, but back to your question about Renault, I think um, it's just an honor to play with him. Uh, I think this might be his last year, depending upon how his injuries and everything heal up. So it would be uh, obviously an honor to play with him out there. He's a great athlete. Um, you mentioned the sideline. How did you feel? The, uh, what improvements did you see in the way the team carried themselves on the sideline? Uh, improvements? I think that there was not nearly as much yelling at the coaches, yelling at each other. Um, people knew what was going wrong, and they were able to talk and have conversations about it as opposed to just yelling, screaming, and just whining about it. So um, that stuff, we're better than that, and I think today we proved that to each other and to our team and the coaches and the, and the owners. Well, so. All right. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yep. All right.